Now, as I said, this is the number one best rated brand at the network, Origami, and this is the thing that started it all. We do have brand new colors. This is like the Mac Daddy. This is the big one. This is the one that everyone has in their garage. I, if you own the heavy duty Origami, please give us a call. We would love to hear from you. Our toll free testimonial line is 1 866 376 8255. So, our special guest, Luca Puto, is here, and I have an announcement about Luca Puto. What? 30 years at HSN, my friend. In April. In April. In April. 30 years. 30 I years. Just, I just was looking into that and I saw that. <laughs> and I know I've been here for 10 years and from yeah. day one, you've always been so wonderful and sweet and uh -oh. welcoming. And you've had many different jobs here at HSN. I have had a lot you of different jobs. You used to be here. like vice president and of broadcasting. Of broadcasting yeah. at the network. I mean, you yeah. really. And I know. I've done it all. Cheesy. He, and I know <laughs> that this is one of your all time oh, favorite. Without question. <laughs> without question. Well, we've been, I've been selling this. Think about this, though. As long as I've been here, eight years selling origami me here. We started eight years ago with this one the, rack. Right, this was the number Just one. Just one, one color, one rack. That's all we had. And now, look, well, when we go through the colors, it's going to oh, blow yeah. your mind. Every can, color in the can rainbow. Can I also tell you about the reviews? They're oh, yeah. As of today. Uh, of mine? Reviews of me? Well, everyone loves you. Okay, thank you. Check him out on Facebook. You'll see what he <laughs> says. 2,800 and 18 reviews are on hsn.com right now. So to almost 3,000 reviews, 2,818. It's a 4.7 out of five stars. All those people weighing in and right. it's still almost a perfect five star review. It's crazy. That's cra that is crazy. Okay, before we go through the colors real quick, I'm just gonna show everybody yeah. why we call it origami, okay? <laughs> because it's named after the ancient Japanese art of paper folding, so. That, my friends, is it right there. Look how thin that is. And Isn't it amazing? It's the weight capacity that blows my mind. Yeah, four inches wide like this, 12 linear feet of storage when it's open. The weight capacity with the wheels is 75 pounds per shelf or 300 pounds total. Without the wheels on it, because you get the choice of putting them on or not, 250 pounds per shelf for a total of 1,000 pounds. That's a half a ton on one of these. And we got colors to beat the band okay. today. Okay, all to right, this? I'm ready. Okay. How, how can I help? What can orange I be your assistant? First. Orange first. Well, here's what we'll do. We're okay. gonna do the one in front of me here. This is the orange. Okay. okay. We, we know orange. Let's okay. go around the back and then okay. we'll start bringing in, because we got so in many. Bringing best friends. Okay. Yeah. This okay. is sage, is that sage green? That's the sage green. Okay. Very good. Okay, but since we're here, can I just mention you that may? we do have the metallic shelves back yes. in stock and the, shelf liners. the, the three pack of these green great little cubbies right. here. So uh, the three packs of the cubes are $39.95. The shelf liners are $29.95. And the connecting racks, I want to make sure we, oh, we mention it. Uh, yes, I was told we do have them. So mm. I'm going to double check okay. and my, my producer. We do have cool. them. Yeah. We do have them because they always sell out and we just got them back. So you I want to make sure. You can two racks together if you buy two or if you have more than one. Okay. And so many people ask for those. Beautiful white, glossy color on this guy. A little yeah. bit of texture on the finish. These, By the way, these are all powder coated steel. This is not paint you're looking at. This is powder coating. A little bit of a difference so right there. So this is black, right? This, good. Last Excellent. Call. That's, last my, call that's my new. I, I don't, don't be impressed that I knew the color. I, I wanted to give an update already. This is a last call. We only have 75 left. 75. Turquoise. Right here. Okay. Okay. Now, <laughs> now we're gonna go now. Things I'm are gonna, gonna get, get out of the way. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Vintage bronze right there. Vintage Take bronze. Take a look at this one. This one is a <laughs> lovely dark uh, sort of chocolate look right there. Nice warm one. Goes with wood and with um, leathers. I'm waiting for one of those to go to our camera one I day. I know. One day. <laughs> you here, do it. <laughs> this is our jade. We have Ooh. several shades of green too. So this is gonna be our jade. Let's do them together. Yeah. Here is the mint. Okay. So jade mint. Oh, Here's okay. the teal. Okay. And, and then, then behind us, you've already turquoise. seen the turquoise and the sage. The sage, right. So here's the sage. So right. that's. This is the teal, mint, and this is the jade. Should I put the sage up there? So yeah, people you want can to, kind sure. Of Bring see. the sage I just, up. I do, because these are honestly, I, I love that. It's, it's like if you're an interior decorator, you could actually get your exact color green. Yeah. So this is the sage green next and to me. And this one down here is the turquoise, the one I'm tapping on. That's okay. The that's the turquoise right there. So, so turquoise, teal, mint, Jade and the sage. Sage green. Okay, okay. so I'm going to put Lots this back. Of greens. Lots, Lots of greens. Lots of greens. Lots of greens that we have here. But you know what? That gives everybody a little choice, doesn't it? Okay? Yeah. Here we go. Coming off one at a time. <laughs> All right. It takes a village to do this sometimes. It Here we is. Go. Okay, next. Now, we're going to do all the varieties of purple in order. This is the amethyst. Okay. This one is the fuchsia. Fuchsia. And here is straight up purple. Okay, so I, it looks like uh, uh, the amethyst is like a lighter pink to me. Kind of, yeah. Okay. It's like a lighter pink. Yeah. Then you've got the fuchsia in the middle, um, and then purple okay. right here on the end. So we've got like the berry clam. We, yeah. we do. All okay. our berry colors here. All right. 
And then, hey, by the way, notice how easy these are to roll on and off. And it's because the wheels on these are just amazing. Is this called navy? Navy blue. Okay. Boom. Even, even, oops, sorry, guys. Even with uh, 300 pounds on these, we'd be able to roll these as we are right now. This is red, obviously. Red, you, didn't, obviously. You, didn't guess, you didn't guess it. I, I could have guessed that. This one is, is this the pewter? This is the original, the original. color. Okay. The original pewter that we started with here, that mottled finish of the silver and the black on here. This is what I, all of mine except for one are this color. Okay, I would actually love to take a phone call. I'm going to go to Michigan and say hi to That's Carol so because Carol has four of these, Lou, and I want to oh. see what color she has. Hi, Carol. You're on live with Lou and Helen. Hi. Hey, Carol. Hey, Carol. You have four. You don't have to press one. We're, we're here live oh, now. Oh, I didn't. Oh, okay, okay. you're good. <laughs> okay, I have 17 of these units all together. I'm addicted to them. <laughs> What, what? I have the big ones in my kitchen because I can't reach my kitchen cupboards to put dishes and stuff in, and I have oh. all the uh, good dishes from you. So mm -hmm. I have all my dishes displayed on them and all my appliances. I thought you said you had, did you really say you had 17? 17. I live in a two-bedroom apartment. I have them in every room but my bathroom. <gasps> oh, my I God. Wow. I all my groceries Carol. on two of them in um, my second bedroom, and I have three in my living room and I've got six in one room. So I obviously you love on. them more than anybody I've ever heard. So tell us, what do you love? Tell us what, what it is about yeah. them. Well, they're so easy to put together and they're so strong that yeah. I know I can put all my items on them and nothing's going to fall. Or, exactly. Um, and they're movable. Yes, movable. Totally movable. Yep. And and it's vertical storage, Carol. So you're making yeah. making the most of every room in, in your in your place. Every inch. And they look nice. Thank they you. They do. Yeah, I they love that. They look nice. I have one in the, in the living room that I put seasonal stuff on. Nice. A tall one, do and you, I put. Do like, you know, Carol? I would actually love it if you took a picture and put it on my Helen Keeney HSN Facebook page because I'm sure everybody watching right now would love to see a picture of a place that has 17 of these. I would. <laughs> If, if you can to do that for you. I would love that. Thank you, Carol. Thanks, Thank Carol. you so much for calling. You do that. I'm going to share it with everybody. Wow. 17. Is 17. That, is that a record? I don't even think that's a you record, You know, though. it's not. We were talking about this morning. Yeah. We've heard up to 30. Really? So, Carol, step it up. <laughs> <laughs> well, a lot of people, I know some people that have, like, a business, and oh, yeah. they have, like, garage no, you know, storage, and well, that they have them. Yeah. Here's why you can do that, though, because think about this. Some people use this at home for storage. Some people use it for furniture. Some people do use it for their businesses if they have, like, um, you know, warehouse product samples, different things that they've got to store. These are perfect for that. And here's why. Remember, this is all, listen to this. That's powder coated steel. So this is real steel, okay? The shelves are three feet long. Mm -hmm. The shelves are also 18 inches deep. So you're getting a foot and a half this way. So you got a lot of room on here, plus airflow, plus water flow, if you mm -hmm. want to use these outside for certain things. Um, and as we mentioned earlier, like we have them here with the wheels on them, you get the, the wheels with it. That's the only thing you have to put on these if you want to. You don't have to. You don't have to. Without the wheels on this, you can put 250 pounds on each one of these shelves for a total of 1,000 pounds. With the wheels, as we have it configured here, it's about three inches off the ground, so we recommend, you know, take it down to about 75 mm -hmm. pounds on each shelf for a total of 300 pounds. But, I mean, think about this. Yeah. You're still able to push around 300 pounds. Oh, yeah, and I have two words, Hurricane Irma. Yes. Because if you live in an area like we do here in Florida where yep. if there's some flooding, all you have to do it's is take up. things off the ground a That's little it. bit, yeah. and you're going to you're gonna save it, really. Yeah. And, no, and you it, will. So I know so many, I, so, so many people have done that for that reason alone. Uh, but, of course, there's so many fun reasons to have it, oh, you right. know, wheeling it in and out. And, of course, when you move, it moves with you. Right. Whether you're, um, you know, you have your potting soil and your gardening supplies or you have your big bins with your holiday decorations oh, on them. Oh, and your them. storage unit, yeah, and your Everything garage. is precious, but you might want to have it off the ground, right. you know, in well, order of how how much you don't want to lose it. I mean, think about this for a second, okay? Think about the rooms in your house where you don't have room to spread out this way, but you could go this way, okay? Right. And all you need is a three-foot space. That's all you have to have. Mm -hmm. Drop a yardstick on the floor. If that fits, this will fit, okay? Right. So you could put in that space, maybe in your laundry room, you know? Know, maybe you don't have enough space in your laundry room for all the things you need, your supplies, for when you're folding things, or even just the laundry baskets. Maybe, you know, you've got a, a big family and you're carrying laundry baskets back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. Guess what? This moves, this rolls. So you can just roll them from place to place. The other thing I like to point out too for folks is with the laundry detergents and the bleaches and stuff like that, no matter how hard you try, you're gonna spill them. Mm -hmm. It's gonna happen. This is powder coated steel, so 
it's not going to hurt this. Okay. You know, you, in fact, I, I tell people, listen, if you had to, you just wheel it out to the driveway and turn the hose on it because it's not going to hurt. Yeah. And, and, you know, Lou, tell me, where do we have it in your house? Okay. I have them <laughs> in my garage. I'm glad you asked. Yeah. I have them. In, I have a bunch in my garage. Right. I've lost count on how many because it changes from like week to week, but there's a bunch in my garage. Right. Four right now, I believe. I actually have them in front of cabinets in my garage because I can move them out of the way when I need Ooh. to. There's another one that's in Kelly's uh, craft room in the closet. She has a teal one in there. Right. She has other stuff on. We got one of the little ones that's sitting in the craft room as well with her cricket on it. Okay. Okay. So we have those in there. Then if you go to my office, they're everywhere. 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 The deco rack that we sell that's in, in uh, Michelle's Because you who probably fill up products that you're working on. Ah, oh my and gosh. Everything. Well, and that's the thing, too, is because when we need them, we open them, we store stuff. When you, we don't need them, we fold them up and we put them away. You also own like a whole production company. Oh, yeah, video production so, company. So, so you've got all your equipment and all that stuff. All that stuff. Oh, yeah. I mean, like our warehouse is full of these. I mean, that, and, you know, that's a good thing because it, honestly, it cost me less money than if I went and bought the ones that I had to put together. And, and you know, have you ever had your stuff in one of those storage? units you pay for monthly. I do now. And it's, yeah, I was oh, going to say. that's the other place where I have. <laughs> yeah, I was going to say they're six. great for that. I have six in my storage unit. I forgot about that. Right, because you can get a smaller storage unit and get vertical storage, because exactly. I've had storage units it, it, throughout my life, and you get a smaller one, you save a lot of money, you could right. do that vertical storage in right. a storage unit, and they fold up to take in and out, you know, so great. Well, and you also don't wait for a cart. Yes. Because you know what I'm talking yes, about. Yes, I do. You, you pull up to the storage unit, and you walk in, and there's no carts, and you're just like, <laughs> waiting right. for somebody to bring one right. down. When I get there, I just walk up to my unit, open the door. I've got six origami racks in there, two rows of three back to back. And I just wheel them out when I need them. I can go all the way down to my truck with them. I can bring them home. So if we're doing Christmas mm -hmm. decorations, I can stack stuff on them. There's so many things you can do. But for a lot of you, it's going to be this. It's going to be the garage. It's going to be getting things right. off the floor in the garage. And maybe for the first time ever in your life, putting your car in, the, in garage. the garage. Tell us about the weight capacity again, because this sure. blows my mind. Well, here's the thing. Like, this guy right here has the wheels on it, so I would say 300 pounds total on the 75 pounds on each shelf. We're nowhere near that right now, okay? Right. But if you have one that's going to be there permanently, you don't put the wheels on it, right. and you can load it up to 250 pounds per shelf. So I'm talking cinder blocks. We're talking pavers. We're talking, you know, river rock, mulch, firewood, anything firewood. like that. Lo oh, you can yeah. load it up. Load up with firewood. Load it up. Yeah. All right, we're going to go back to the phone. So we're going to cool. go to Alabama and say hi to uh, Dulce. Uh, you're on live with Lou and Helen. So I just wanted to say this is the best product I have ever bought. Thank you. I have it in wow. my kitchen pantry. Okay. In my laundry room. All right. It carries tons of heavy enameled cast iron, mm -hmm. vegetables. I can roll it around easy even with a heavy load on it. And at Thanksgiving and Christmas when I wanted to cook, I put everything on it, moved it into the kitchen was able to have everything right in my hands and move it right back out. So it's if everybody, terrific. if somebody's and listening at home, Dulce. the box and it's together in five minutes. Together in five minutes. I was Perfect. just going to, yeah, you're so it. good. I was going to ask you, what was that like when you, to put it together? Were you, what did you, I mean, was it, like that. tell us what your experience was. Did it take you longer to open the box than it did to unfold it? <laughs> it actually took me longer to get the box in the house. <laughs> yeah. I ordered the two pack. Yeah. And oh. It took me about five minutes to get it in, but it went together so easy, all I'm, by myself, and I, I'm I love over it. 60, so. That's I my love favorite it. thing. All by yeah. yourself. I love Thank that. Thank you so much for calling in, Dulce. I really appreciate it. And you know, Rob, I would love to show the extras that we have, because I know so many people like Dulce and our last caller has 17 of them. Yeah. We have the shelf, um, and these are these have magnets on them, yep. and you can pop them on, and I know the shelf liners are $29.95. They're under uh, all under the same item number, so the connecting rack is also available, and there is the uh, there's the liners and the cubes. Uh, right. The cubes are thirty nine ninety five, and the connecting rack is forty nine ninety five, and that's and we're going to show that on air too because I know so many people ask about the connecting they rack. They do, and you you get two of those, and on any two racks you can connect them on any level that you want to. So if you want to make an entertainment center, you can do these two, or if you just want to have two shelves continuous, you can do those two. But they're strong. Once they get on there, they just use hooks to go on there that are attached to them. But once they're on there, you can move the whole unit, and it gives you nine straight feet of Ooh, storage. That's great. I should mean, we, think about that. Should, should we try to do the colors one more time yeah, in the, the last couple minutes? Sure. Okay. Okay. All right. So we'll do an update when we get to colors. So we'll start orange. with the orange. <laughs> this is the, this is the, the orange we've been playing with this whole time. Take a look okay. at that. Okay. Good on orange. All right. 